How many hours did we spend of our lives doing this right now? Can somebody do the math? Because it's been a lot of hours. A lot of hard work, sweat, and tears have been put into this. Is it worth it? That's the real question, right? Is it worth it? Was this all worth it? Who really knows, man? What is even worth it means? Just so y'all know, I'm about to quit out of this game. Ready? Y'all ready? I just quit out the game. Come on. We got to run that back. Let's play it one more time. I don't want to be done. I don't want to be done. We got to do it again. We got to do it again, guys. We got to play one more time, bro. We quit out the game. Let's go. Come on. Let's run that back. Let's run that back. We're going to play again. We're going to play again. Big W's. Keep spamming the W's, bro. Let's go. We're going to play one more time. I can't finish spotless. I'm just kidding. You know it counts, baby. Let's go. Last player. Shit. Let's get it. I was just mad. I got it. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, baby. I got caught. I caught all of y'all. Caught all of y'all. What's up? All right. Let's go. Where are we going? Rewards. Spotlight Sims. West, do you want to lock in? No, I do not want to lock in. Guess what? We just messed it up, man. Man, yo, what happened? Lock in. Welcome to the squad, man. I got to go redeem him first. Let's go redeem him. All right. Before I redeem this card, because he's all the way over there. He's all the way over there. Before I redeem that card. Oh, look, I got Rex Chapman. I got Rex Chapman. We were wondering where the Rex went. He's right here. Yo, I didn't know that. Let's go. Diamond Rex is right here. All right. We're going to open every single pack first. Now nah, I'm just playing. Imagine. Pink Diamond. Brandon Ingram. Welcome to the squad. How you doing, my man? Look at that glow. It's cute, but that's not the glow we're here for. Definitely not the glow I'm here for. Turn. Let's go, man. I love the W's. Thank you, guys. Thank you for spamming the W's. Everyone here on the Twitch stream, appreciate y'all. We stream every day on Twitch. Y'all the goats. Brandon Ingram, Mr. Slender Man himself. Bro, how can someone be that skinny, bro? I met this dude. Bro, he's just so low. Never mind. I'm not going to say that. I was going to say he's so... Never mind. I'm not going to say that again. All right. 22 cards away. 22 cards away from Galaxy Opal D-Wade. And we're going to add one more to that mess. One more is going to get added right now. Are y'all ready? Y'all not ready. Would you like to lock in? Of course. Why wouldn't I want to lock in? Do I lose anything with these two Bs? Nope. Now, y'all not ready. D-Wade's coming soon. Facts. Let's get it, y'all. James Harden, welcome to the squad. We pulled an Opal, guys. No money spent. We got ourselves an Opal. The grind is over, officially over. Oh, he's so beautiful, bro. The Opal grinds. We took our time. Houston Rocket, wonder who it could be. Shooting guard, Tracy McGrady. Yo, he got his Hardens on, I like that. He's wearing Hardens, those are nice. There we have it, y'all. We made it, man. Point guard, shooting guard, James Harden, Galaxy Opal. Shout out to everyone that was on the Twitch stream. Like I said, I stream every day on Twitch. It's a lot of fun. It's a free app. You guys should check it out. Promise you, you won't be disappointed. Now, this card has 38 Hall of Fame badges. We're going to get into it. We're going to talk about basically whether I think he's worth it. We're going to go through some of his animations and what we expect coming out of 2K in the future. So first of all, I know most of you guys probably already seen gameplay on James Harden. You already know more or less what's going on. The catch and shoot, floor general, all that good stuff. He did get quick draw Hall of Fame added to him the other day. It was adjusted. So now his jump shot is faster. He obviously has the range, the ankle breaker, all that good stuff. I'll go through some of them just just because not everyone probably seen everything we got hot star dimer hot zone hunter green machine pickpocket flexible dead eye clamps unpluckable interceptor tight handle space creator quick first step you see pretty much everything man the contact the consistent the downhill he's got a lot of good badges to say the least he's got lightning reflexes pogo stick and honestly it's a really good card the problem is how many hours you're putting in so he's six five he can run the one like I said, which is one of the main reasons I went for him. I need a new point guard. Yes, until I get D-Wade. Once I get D-Wade, probably going to be my new point guard. Maybe move hard into the two. We'll figure it all out. But right now, this guy has a 98-3, 96 mid-range, 98 free throw, of course. What's his draw foul? 99. Of course, you already know. We draw fouls with this man. 98 ball handling, 92 steal, 89 perimeter, and 82 interior. 
the 70 block bro he's a defender he's really good look at the rebounding the 96 speed 96 speed with ball 94 lateral quickness you gotta love it man for a free card if you guys don't know if this is your first time watching me I have not spent a dollar on this game. This is our squad. We grind out for the cards that are hard to get, like your Brandon Roy's, your Giannis's. I gotta get all these free cards because at the end of the day, we really don't have any other option. We can't go ahead and buy a Tracy McGrady, who might just be as good, if anything. But I think this Harden is good. Um, The issue is, if you guys don't know how to get him, you're gonna have to play single player challenges spotlights. You're gonna have to go through 30 teams of five games each. So they take about two hours each, about you got 30 teams. So you're talking about 60 hours of hard work labor. It's literally a grind. So do I recommend it? Only if you have something to evolve, something to watch, something to do. Otherwise, I would say probably not. Now, one thing we are expecting is something big coming out of this Harden. So people are saying that there might be new challenges coming because Ronnie keeps saying and 2K keeps saying that we're going to need this Harden for something. What do we need this Harden for? Maybe all these hot zones, beautiful hot zones. Oh, I need to turn that shot meter off though. I don't like shot meter, but we'll keep it on for a little bit. For all you guys that use the shot meter, we could look at it real quick. But yeah, so basically, Harden was said that he's going to be needed for something. Jump shot is interesting to say the least. I'm going to keep getting slightly late. I feel like I'm slow with it, but I'm guessing that means I'm just shooting it a little too slow. I'm guessing I'm catching it on the way down. So we got to shoot it a little faster. That was late. It felt late. All right, we're going to get used to the jump shot. Let me turn the shot meter off so I don't get distracted because I think it distracts me a little bit too much. Now I got it off, so I'm just going to shoot more slightly late and I'm just going to live with it. We're going to figure out his jump shot, of course. I'm sure he has a good one. I'm sure a lot of people like it. I'm sure it's not bad. And lates are better than earlys. That's our first green right there. Let's go. Can I green again? No, now we're just late. Not even slightly late. Now we're late. There we go. Another green. Come on, let's get this green rolling. Green rolling. I feel it. All right, so back to those challenges we were talking about. So maybe we have like challenges where you got to do more sim challenges to get kobe or something that might be a possibility i heard his dunk package is nasty so i'm excited to check that out we could take him to triple threat and take a look for sure but yeah so basically what we're hearing is this could be connected to kobe somehow it's a possibility it could be connected to something big maybe not even kobe but something else so we're just waiting to find out what is going on we're gonna wait see and we're gonna pretty much see what's going on i love his animations they feel pretty good i don't know how to dribble i know a lot of people do know how to dribble and i feel like he's pretty good for a guy that doesn't know how to dribble in myself i feel like he's very fast he's able to do a lot of cool moves you could probably peekaboo really really well with this card so you gotta realize once you get hard and you're actually getting siakam and ingram as well siakam is pretty solid i think he's really good he's 6'9 he's got a lot of badges this is one of my favorite cards in the game right now he's got 28 hall of fame badges 26 gold he plays really really well like honestly and then we just got brandon ingram we haven't played with him like that yet but he has 27 hall of fames 23 golds and it's time to actually see how these guys roll i'm gonna play triple threat online with all three see how it goes and hopefully we can dominate i think they can i think they should be able to do so and let's see what we can do and here's our matchup man this guy has no chance bro that picture says it all let's get it hard and oh nah straight to the basket nah let me let me let me play with him a little bit come here come back here oh you're gonna on ball him oh yeah come on pull up three bang in his face can't guard me let's see the defense on this brandon roy okay roy okay i see that little snatch back okay yo Harden, you gotta be there, boy. Show him what's up. He wants to snatch back. Snatch back in his face, bro. Snatch back in his face. Right there, and we still got it. All right, here we go. Harden got a rebound coming the other way. Do I do another? Oh, oh, he is so fast. He really is fast. Do I let anyone else score or nah? Honestly, it's Harden's gameplay, baby. We seeing if he's worth it. I'll see you all later. It's Harden time. Look at him, man. He's just a basket he's literally a basket i'm not saying he's not i just don't know if 60 hours is worth it a lot of you guys ask what i want to say is if you have not nothing better to do but if you have the time to grind it and you feel like you'll enjoy it you won't like complain if you have stuff to evolve maybe you can buy cards and try to evolve them to like make some mt other than that man i really don't know but he is fast He's definitely a walking bucket. There's no way pretty much any guard can guard him. Wow, this Roy is actually doing work. It's easy to like defend somebody when you know all they want to do is score with that player. I mean, you can't really stop him, but I really suck at doing gameplays. So I'm using Nick Nurse as my coach. You see he gets sharp takeover off that. If you guys don't know, coaches change takeovers as well as shoes and they do work in triple threat online. We're going to end it on a step back. I'm just kidding. I'm not really good at step backs, but we're going to try it. Let's see. Bang. Bang. 
Oh! Oh! Step back green! Oh! 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 Step back green for the game winner. You gotta love it. James Harden, welcome to the squad. Solid 21 points, 9 of 11. I probably shouldn't have missed. I probably shouldn't, but he was fun. I was messing around with him a lot. I took a bad shot here or there. It is what it is. Great, great card. Worth it really depends on you and your time and what you're doing. If you have a lot of MT or spend a lot of VC and all that, probably not worth your time because you could do other things and get other things done in that time period. But if we find out that this Harden is like linked with a Kobe or something else that you had to have gotten this card first, then in that case, it will be worth it, I think, in my opinion, 100%. But till we find out, we don't know. I will keep you guys up to date. I hope you guys enjoyed. Shout out to everyone that got Harden and bruh. Woo, this boy is a beast. But yeah, before we go, I just wanted to remind you guys there are players on the boards. So if you guys can play triple threat or want to, there are a lot of different players. We've seen Rex and Zach Randolph. Other people have seen a lot of other cards. There are a lot of cards on there right now, mostly rewards. So if you want to go ahead and get some of those rewards, go ahead and do so. Also, here is a locker code that was released today for anyone that didn't see it yet. Good luck. And let me know if you did pull anyone from it, especially if you made it this far in the video. I know a lot of you guys don't make it this far. But yeah, with all that said, guys, it's been your boy Most Bowling. Leave me a like. It really does help me out a lot. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see y'all later. It's been your boy Most Bowling, and Bowling.